Hi there guys, and this second part of discovering and exploring color, I am going to show you how we are going to do the butterfly and the rainbow. On part one, we learned how to make a rainbow just like this with hole punch paper. Okay guys, the hole punch paper in your computer in your school computer you can ask your teachers to get it for you and you can use them and recycle that paper we don't need to throw it in the garbage okay kids first thing first okay so on part one we made this other rainbow too okay i did it with you on part one okay kids look how pretty it is now on part two we're going to make and let's see if we have time to make the flower and the butterfly all in one if we don't have time we'll do one and then part three will come but hopefully we don't need part three okay let's get going the flower i printed out of the computer and i glued it in my nice piece of color here and this butterfly i did print it out out of the computer I can show you later on in another video how you can draw your own butterfly if you want to. Okay, for this flower, because it doesn't have any leaves, I am going to cut paper here, green paper. See it? Any piece of paper you get. Just go a piece of paper and, and just go this, you know, fold it like that. A little piece of paper, green paper, to make your leaves for your flower and then all you do is you cut it just like this kids see you just cut it like this see and then what you do is you cut this in half right then you cut it in half now you have two parts of it then glue it use some glue Get some glue going, kids. Cutting and gluing. Oh, we all like cutting and gluing. And I'm going to put this in here too. This is a little bit. We have some leaves, but it doesn't look that great. <laughs> but we can do whatever we want, can't we? There we go. I glue some green on the leaves of my flower you see now i am going to lower this so we can see how we do this i have a bunch of different color food coloring of all color i have some different pieces of paper i cut myself i just folded a piece of paper like this and i cut it like this guys you know, I just did a whole bunch of cutting just like this. And then what you do is to get all those pieces, you just cut them like this. I'll show you. I will show you how we do this. And this is so awesome for our fine moral skills. Mostly for kindergartners and grade ones, even grade twos. Need to develop those fine moral skills. So see, and then you just cut it. Yeah, it's gonna be all over the place. Just try to lower your scissor. And then you cut all those little tiny pieces. Because we'll, we can use those too, to glue them on the rainbow, or to glue them on the flower, or to glue them on our butterfly. Right, guys? So I'll show you with all these pieces of paper how we're going to do our butterfly. First of all, you print it out of the computer, get a piece of color paper, and then gather all your color. If you wanted to color it, you can color it, but in this example, I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna use a whole bunch of different colors of piece of paper here, okay? And first thing, I am going to get all the outside in yellow, okay, because that's the most I have cut already. Okay, so just glue all this line of your butterfly, guys. All this yellow. Okay. 
Okay, oh, a little piece of blue here. We don't want blue here right now. Let's get rid of there. Oh. Let's clean this too. Always have paper towels. Always have an old rag because you don't want to make a mess in your house, okay, kids? And then, oh, this is this is this small, small. No, it isn't. I didn't tell you guys to do that. Okay. And I go all the way around here too. With glue. Only glue, kiddos. The glue first, okay? In between these lines. Your glue first in between the lines here, kiddos. There we go. Glue, 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 all over the place here, kids. There. Right. There we go. All around your butterfly, you are going to put some glue. Okay. There we go. Now, I am going to use my color yellow. See, I'm going to try to put all this yellow here. My kids, they look so nice too, guys. I do not have enough yellow, but hopefully when I shake off all the leftover yellow pieces of paper, maybe I will have enough, right? Well, guess what? We need to cut more yellow paper here. So I already have it almost done. So what we need to do is, is just cut some more. Right, kids? Just cut some more. That's it's always. And you know what? What you do, kids? You can pour all your pieces on top of your glue right now. So here we go. Put it in there. So maybe you just have to start with small pieces. Like it. There we go. There we go. This is fun. Cutting and gluing. <laughs> the best. I love cutting and gluing. Oh yeah, my favorite thing in the world. Yeah, got some more in and more because it looks like I'm going to need a whole bunch. So you cut as you go, okay, as you need. Keep on cutting. Keep on cutting. Well, you cut, you can sing too. So, guess what, kiddos? So, here it is. I have a whole bunch. I can move it around so it goes where I need it. Right, kids? There we go. Oh, I forgot to put glue under here in this part. Huh. There we go. See, now you can see what you miss putting glue. There we go, kids. Silly me. And I hear two kids. There we go. Perfect. Oh, this line too. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. Oh. So. See, you can get all your color where you want it, kids. See?
very awesome very awesome there we go we got this we got it just push it and put it where it needs to be kids push it in colore il tipo salve there we go color 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 bunch of colores there and there is my butterfly kids oh, this is awesome mm -hmm. Butterfly done. There we go. And then inside you can put way more color if you want to, kids. It's up to you. You can put more color. Always remember how to paper towel to clean all this because I touched that red color there for the rainbow and look what happened. So in the inside you can use can use purple you can use any color you want actually but it doesn't matter I am going to use some purple in here and I am going to use this purple color you can use your paintbrush but me I don't have a paint brush I don't have a paint brush and that's why I am going to use this color a straw because I don't have a paintbrush. Water kids. And you can just be creative and do whatever you want inside here. Put whichever color you want. Because it is your art anyways and doesn't matter. Whatever color you want to use, go for it. You can use any color you want. It is like, oh no, you don't need to use this. Yes, you use whichever color you want. It's your art. Like it. Any color like this. There we go. This looks so nice. there all done bam we have a butterfly here spring is here two more days springtime look guys is it that cool Yay. and then we are going to color this flower too let's color the flower what can we use we can use markers for our flower let's use pink pink flower a pink flower so we can finish this up faster see so see for your spring art you can use pencil crayons you can use highlighter you can use food coloring you can use this coloring you can use color paper you can use hole puncher stuff right kids you can use whatever you want and you print your picture from the computer your template and then you do your work or you can draw it too right kids now i'll show you what am i going to do with my flowers to finish it up there we go. Right. Right. There we go. 
all done. My final art in two parts. See? Happy Easter, happy springtime, kids. Enjoy and try this in your classroom or at home. Okay, kids? Paper, hole puncher. This is a paper for your butterfly. Pencil, crayons, glue, glue stick, liquid glue, straw if you don't have a paintbrush, and all the things. Okay, kids? Adios amigos. Talk to you guys later.